Hi there, welcome to One in a Million. In this video we are going to learn, dating tutorial. Three ways to get a date. And on our next video we will learn how to date, what to do in a date. Please subscribe our channel to get more tutorials. Going on a date with someone, can be a lot of fun for both of you. However, asking for a date can be a difficult and intimidating experience. Thankfully you don't have to leave the process up to luck. Learning more about the psychology behind asking for a date can help you to better understand the process and increase your chance of success. Don't ask for a date immediately. Asking outright for a date can dramatically lower the chances of the other person agreeing. Instead of simply approaching someone and asking if they would like to go on a date with you, start by asking a simple question or favor first. You can also use this question to start a longer conversation and learn more about the person before asking them out. Say something positive. If you are approaching someone in a public space, it can be difficult to think of something to open your conversation with. When you open up this conversation you will want to focus on something positive about the area you find yourself in. Keeps the conversation going? After you start a conversation, you will need to keep it going. The key is to listen and pay attention to what they are saying, both verbally and with body language. Start the conversation off slowly and look for details that they offer which you can use to keep the conversation going. Make a good first impression. First impressions are formed almost automatically when two people meet for the first time. These judgments are made quickly based on behavior, dress, appearance, and anything that is said during the meeting. By making a good impression, you can help increase your chances of getting a date when you ask. Use the right body language. There are many non-verbal methods that you can use to convey your interest in the person you are speaking with. By using these in conjunction with your verbal conversation, you can help express your confidence and let the other person know that you find them interesting. Wear the right colors. If you plan on going out to look for a date, you should consider what colors you are going to wear. Color can have an effect on people and leave a certain impression, depending on which hue you are wearing. Make sure the colors you have on when looking for a potential date are sending the right messages. Make the date a suggestion. When you are asking someone what their plans are, and if they want to go on a date with you, asking indirectly can be the best way to do so. Using indirect phrasing can make the other person feel less pressure and allow them to answer honestly. Frame the date as their own idea. As you ask someone out on a date, you can try to phrase your request in a way that will make the other person feel as if it was their own idea. People are often more comfortable with their own thoughts and ideas and are more likely to agree to your plan for the date. Explain the benefits. One way of asking for a date involves phrasing your request in a way that highlights the benefits of going. By presenting a reason why it would be a good idea to go with you on this date, the other person will be more likely to agree to the date. Ask directly. Some people won't like indirect questioning, and it may come off as manipulative. If you think the person you are going to ask on a date would prefer the direct approach, you should ask them in that manner. This method avoids any potentially lost or misunderstood meaning and gets directly to the point. If you like this video please don't forget to give us a like and also subscribe to our channel for more videos. Thanks for watching.